So pretty quiet. I don't know. I think they uh I think they changed it. Dragon Dragon just leaves. I don't know why they would do that, but they did. All right, so where does where does this take me? Shortcut of a sort. All right, I turned off the dialogue. I should fix that. Oh, this is how you actually get to the boss. I was wondering about that. Well, oh, there it is. Yup. Uh, that's what I expected. What else do we have around here? Excuse me, sir. Excuse me. Excuse me. Excuse none of the shenaniganry. Thank you. Say hello to Phalanx. Don't worry. I'll say hi to him real good. I said, I wonder if I'm going to bike a mile while I'm playing Demon Souls. I've been bad about it. I need to remember to actually pedal here. I've just been sitting here with my... Ow. Dang these dudes with their sweepy ass spear shots. Nope, that didn't work. There he goes. I never get good at these games. I just learn how to cheese it better. That's how it works for me. Who are you? Good sir. I wonder. Like, maybe Sekiro I learn how to... No, even Sekiro I don't learn how to be good at. I just cheese my way through it. Like a champion. Oh. Look, it's a phalanx blob. If I remember right, magic mucks these guys up pretty bad. But I could also be quite wrong on that one. Okay. I just want to get the shortcut set up, then we'll go back to the... The blue dragon. Ow. That was a non-animation. Man, I can't see shit in here. <laughs> there we go. Yeah, so the shield does not block there. Just while the pine resins there is to teach you the fire is good. Who needs fire when you have me? All I have to do is just cast magic. Then problem solved. Well, I'm going to have a whole lot of the good Healy stuff. Okay, let's go back. I want to go take a look at that blue dragon for a smidge. There was a lower section there that I did not check out for items. And now would be a decent time for it, seeing as, you know, I've killed everything in the way. Oh, let's see, can Wonder switch to the shield whenever he wants? Yes. I just don't switch to it much. And the issue is most players won't have the MP regen ring this early, but I am a wizard and I picked royalty because I said rings are probably more valuable than literally anything else in this game, and I was right. Rings are the good shit. Alright, we've been this way. Okay. In Demon Souls, rings are the most important? I'd say so. 
They're like one of the only ways you actually get interesting or unique features. Ish. Okay. Well, let's see what's over here. Is it this one or Dark Souls that had the useless amulet? I don't remember any that are like explicitly useless. So it's probably this one. I'm not getting toasted for being here. Dark Souls 1, The Pendant. Okay, so that was a useless one. I'm gonna take one more pot shot at this blue dragon, see if I can hit it. Yeah, it looks like it looks like the red dragon just pieces out. Nope. Cannot hit that thing. Alright. Uh, let's see. Oh, I don't have the homeward boner. Well, I guess we're walking. All the way back. But then it's boss time. Then we actually get to level up. And then, then I feel like the game starts opening up in a better way. It's just, uh, I honestly don't remember how long this area was. I Like, it... It must have been this long, obviously years ago when I when I played this the first time around, but maybe it's just my memory condenses everything down. Or time. Or just I only remember bits and pieces, the highlights of Demon Souls. So everything else past that point is just kind of like, eh, whatever. I mostly just remember the weird trashy boss fights. It was like the big flying manta ray thing and the dragon just being like, these don't make sense. Why would you put them into this game? But it was super obvious, like, they didn't really know what they were doing th with this game. And, like, it wasn't until Dark Souls where they really hit their stride. And it was like, oh, yeah, this is how this works. Which I, I will give them major credit for. I probably should have killed all these guys. When I came through. Yeah, now they're just kind of in my way. Yeah, we're gonna we're gonna very quickly go back. Might as well get my mana back so we can do horrid things to the uh, the phalanx as we go along. Did were you dead? Did I do that? I must have done that. Okay. Touch the thing. Back we go. I think they wanted to weed out anyone who would give up with this first level. That, yeah, that makes sense. And then we go fast straight into the boss. Because I want to save my gibbs if I can. Excuse me, sir. None of that malarkey. Out of my way, I've got a slime blob to murder. Sup, flanks? Ow. Okay, holy shit, this is dark. Now, I don't know about you guys, but I like cheese. I'm not, like, terribly possessed by the desire to consume cheese at all times or be a grand purveyor of cheese. Ow. But in a situation where I can hawk some cheese... For the betterment of mankind. I will. Okay. 
problem is the lighting in here is really uneven. This is going to take a bit. It only takes about two shots to kill each and every one of these. Oh, and if I get lucky, I hit multiple with a shot. Might actually be a lot easier than I thought it was going to be. Never mind. Holy shit, that's a lot. Turns out there is just less up front. Ugh. Oh, well, that's pretty much it for all my juice. Okay, now for all the marbles. But what about grenades? Oh shit, that's a good point. I was kind of hoping not to kill Blobulus Prime or even hit it. Flip side, shit that works. The thing is, these fire bombs do kind of atrocious things to this dude. Uh, let's see. Heal up. Maybe we have the pine resin, but. Come on, form up. I got some fire bombs to send to sell to you. We got five more. I ain't gonna use this shit like anywhere else anyway. There we go. Yeah, problem is it really really does hurt the uh the phalanx here. Whenever I hit him, but that's fine. He'll survive. Okay, excuse me, little last Pokemon. Let's see, I can probably take one more hit. There we go. Uh, you know what? I probably picked up enough cast juice. Well, nerves itself. Actually, remember to heal. Do you not want to kill the boss? Sort of. I'm doing a dumb thing. Let's be honest here. You know me. You know I operate in these situations. There's a trick to this boss. A trick that is a complete goddamn waste of time. That... Why would anybody do this, you ask? Because I can. And that's all the justification I need to do anything in life. Okay, one more. Alright, is loose? Nope. Bit dry. Alright, is that all of them? I think so. Well then, easiest boss in Dark Souls. What's up, Goon? Man, they look, made you look real nice. It's like a weird slime thing holding up a root crown. Anyway, yeah, so we, we've pretty much gotten rid of anything and everything that this boss could possibly have. I wonder if the reason why it's so goddamn dark. I did turn up the is it game. Ah, display adjustment. I'm gonna turn down the contrast a bunch. I wonder if part of the reason why it's like virtually impossible to tell what the hell's going on at all times. Yep, it's because I cranked the contrast so high. Uh, 
Alright. Oh. Turn that down a bunch. There we go. Oh, that looks so much better. I should have just uh, gone with the default settings. Because you now I can actually see things in the interior sections. Oh yeah, don't forget about dialogue. Yep. Oh, let me... There we go. So, uh... Oh, I, I know Proflex here. There we go. That's the stuff. Hostess. I'm gonna punch this slime. I'm gonna pound this blob. Be any, there won't be anything left. Heavy attack. Oh, look at the panache on that uppercut. It's not worth it, but still. Oh, wait, better than that? Oh, you can't combo these attacks. I can just... I can just hit him with my wand. <laughs> uh, it's better to just punch it. Plus, it doesn't take any durability this way. Oh, man. I have not commented on this, but the PS5 controller is solid. Like, this is probably one of the most ergonomic controllers I've ever held. Uh, let's see, if you empty both hands, you can combo. Good to know. You can kind of combo, yeah. Man, can you imagine playing this whole game barehanded? I'm sure it's a thing, and I'm sure people do it. Holy shit, I will never- I will not be that person. The other problem I'm noticing is the- the left- the left hook doesn't always hit it. At least not in its current state, so I'm gonna have to- I'm gonna have to just switch to the right hand. Well, let's see, up strength for more damage. Uh, that's a good point. Uh, let's see. Oh, ring of great great strength does not increase. Uh, that does not increase my hitting damage. There you go. That was a little loud. What? Is there no trophy for punching it to death? Makes sense. You regained your body. Bring more souls. Slay more demons. To the Nexus. And no other boss could you do this to. Oh, absolutely. Well, that's fine. Welcome back. The monumental awaits the above. Games loading screens are amazing fast. I am so looking forward to that on the PS5. I might honestly load up Monster Hunter World uh, just for a bit, just to see how fast the loading screens are. The monumental will explain the nexus to thee. Right, so that's a bit of a path. But first, I want to level up. The monumental awaits. The, the monumental will. Explain. Well, okay, cannot level up. <laughs> up we go. Why do I have limited stamina in here? Oh, I took the wrong staircase. See, why did they change the maiden in black's voice? Might not have been able to get the same voice actress. Gosh, I forgot how big this place is. Oh, 
Hello. Is this it? Current profile. What? Recent profile. Nope, that ain't it. Uh, I missed. What is the point of this? Oh, hi. Okay, here we go. That's a tiny little cutaway. Gosh, it looks amazing. I would love to see them remaster Dark Souls 2 and 3 with these visual effects. I know they won't, but it would be cool all the same. Okay. We have long awaited you, Slayer of Demons. I am one of the Monumentals. We preserve the fabric of reality. There is a tale I wish to tell you. Once, we too, a scourge of demons faced. Immediate black screen. Oh, In the here distant we go. past, under benevolent rule, the world was united owing to the soul arts. Until a lust for power caused the awakening of the old one. Across the land seeped a colorless, deep fog, and the world mm. faced extinction at the hands of the demons. Thanks be, we were able to lull the old one back to its slumber. Yet only after the loss of innumerable souls, and most of the world, lost, erased by the fog. In order to mend the fabric of what land still remained, we entrusted six leaders with six precious archstones. One to the king of a small yet industrious land. One to the king of the burrowers underground. One to the wise queen of the great ivory tower. One to the chieftain of lost and ill-fortuned souls. One to the shaman of the tempest-worshipping shadowman and the last to the great giants of the northern lands. The archstones were placed in the fringelands that survived. We contained the old one here below the nexus and prohibited the soul arts. Finally, we became monumentals, half living sentinels of the fabric of reality. Alas, the other monumentals have perished, and only I remain. Okay. By the power of the monumental, the four sealed archstones have been unlocked. Is there anything else here? That's kind of where I came from. Let's check the other direction real quick. Now it is your turn. Peace, weird baby. Yeah, I do not remember the character huffing and puffing to this degree. Like, at all. Yeah, we're always huffing and puffing. Dude needs cardio. Well, alright. Up we go, then back down we go. It's, I mean, it's absolutely visually stunning. Wait, where am I going again? I'm lost. This feels like the wrong direction. But at the same time, I go it proudly and then realize there's nothing here. Back down we go. Well. 
Alright, fine. I'll just start exercising myself. We'll both be huffing and puffing by the end of this. Is there anything in these side passages? No, this... This is how you get to him. Okay. So I just had to turn left there. Easy peasy. I've got a little under-the-desk elliptical thing just kind of in front of me that I've been kind of slowly paddling at. Not very well. It's one of those where it's just a little tough to get, like, the, uh... To convince myself to just keep pedaling idly while I'm playing. Maybe if I increased the, uh, the resistance a bunch, so I had to do it very slowly. Maybe that'd do the trick. Yeah, that probably does the trick. Okay. Brave soul for whom death is no fear. Pretty. Lull the old one back to its ancient slumber. Eye stones briefly connect diffused worlds. Should you lose your physical form, remember the eye stone. Maiden in black manipulates souls with inhuman prowess. Her strength allows her to aid slayers of demons. What is it? Seekest thou the power of souls? I Seek understand. Soul power. Pray forgive me. Perhaps I thought wrongly of you. I am sorry. I mean, I gotta... My face is perpetually on fire, so... I am old. I was here when the old... Yeah, how do I level up with you? Or... Do I go to the statue now, now to level up? Ah, make offering. Nope, that ain't it. Oh, I said no by accident. What is seek a salve? Yes. Of course. After. Why go does... ahead. Touch the demon inside me. Gross. Let these vagabond souls become thine own. Why is no the default? Soul of the mind. Okay, raises magic power, raises miracle power, miracle Soul memory, magic defense, and discovery some vessel. items. Let strength be granted so the world might be mended. Let's so be honest here. Might be mended. There's only one thing that's actually useful here. Art thou finished? Nope. May thy Inventory. I guess it's through here. Okay, I don't remember if those are useful. Do you use the demon souls Master, for anything other than just souls? The demon inside me. Soul of the mind, key to life's ether. Okay. So anyway, from its vessel. then I started blasting. Art thou finished? Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch. In you. Okay. Now, don't you have the souls? Oh, I do have the souls in here. I forgot I put these away. Okay. Now here's the question. I think these actually do have weight. I'm gonna put away the pine resin. I guess I should you probably figure out what they do, gold. and if they do have weight. Okay. Yes, all of these have weight. Not much, but they do. Oh, Archstone Shard teleports us back. So, yeah, we should probably put away almost everything, because I'm not gonna have the carry capacity for any of this. That's a lot of souls. Oh, thank God. I was worried sick. So failing soul gives good buff when transmuted. Okay. I don't even know where to do that, and that's okay. We are indebted to Hello. Wait, I'm not done. Yeah. I was worried sick. Okay, organized storage. So, I'm just going to put away pretty much everything. Oh, uh, wait. Hold up. Those are materials, aren't they? 
We are indebted to you. Oh, good. I can forge weapons for you. Okay, let's upgrade. Maybe my scimitar? Maybe. The thing is, the rapier is just always stupid good. Oh, can I not upgrade my focus? Well, that's obnoxious. I... No interest, eh? I can tell you're not going to last long here. Okay, so pre-order stuff can't be upgraded, nor can the starting catalyst. Good to know. Oh, I was worried sick. Okay. So I think the rings don't have weight. Uh, I'm not going to... I'm not actually going to use any of these. I can't use any of the shields anyway. Let's, um... We Let's switch back to the rapier. For you fight on our behalf. Is this, it's got a little bit more range. This sweep was, was nice. Oh. But I don't think I need it. Okay. We so that should I can lighten my load a bit. Uh, repair all? Ooh. A little pricier than I wanted it to be. Okay, do we upgrade this? Sure. Oh. There's also Fire Rapier. I think? Oh, wait, no, 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 no. The Melt Stone just resets it back to normal. I don't have enough Sharp Stone Shards. I think you might be able to buy some from this guy. But I don't care. Do come I back alive. Care. I need your business. Oh, I was worried sick. Okay. Organize. Hey, realistically, I can probably store... Or, yeah, I can just store all of these. I'm not going to be upgrading them. We are indebted to you. Then touch the demon. Okay. Touch the Soul demon. Of the mind, key to life's ether. More magic. Soul of the lost. Withdrawn from its vessel. Let strength be granted so the world might be myself. I am only here to tend to each flame. I keep the candles lit and serve the brave demon slayers who are trapped here. I keep the candles lit and serve the brave. Art thou finished? May thy strength. Have you met the last surviving monumental? Those fools revived the old one on a whim. And now, they've trapped us here in the Nexus in a desperate attempt to undo their mistake. It's all a travesty, if you ask me. I can forge weapons for you. If you haven't heard, there's another blacksmith at the entrance to Stonefang Mine. He's an eccentric old man. He knows his trade well. He's the only sane one left in a town of soul-starved men. If you do meet him... No, forget it. That stubborn old Nidibel will just chase you off. There aren't enough smithing tools in this temple to handle all the work. Only certain ores can be used to forge weapons. But you'll just have to make do. And be thankful that I can do anything for you at all in this forsaken place. And be thankful that I can do anything. No interest, eh? I can tell you you're not going to last. Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on your belongings, don't you worry. When the scourge came, I abandoned my wife and daughter and fled like a coward. When I came to, I was in this nexus. I haven't dared venture outside these walls since. 
Can you actually leave? I wish I could do more. But <laughs> I am ignorant of the world beyond these walls. That candle maiden cared for me during my first days here. She says very little, but has a kind heart. She's just the age my young daughter would have been. Poor, poor girl. Trapped here with her eyes occluded by wax. If only something could be done to help her. Okay, so put the jade hair hair ornament into storage. You have okay. a heart of gold. Don't let them take it from you. <laughs> Says the guy whose face is permanently on fire. Uh huh. Back in the time that I lived below Bonataria Castle, King Alant left on some strange business, then returned with horrible demons in tow. Soon, the land was ravaged by soul-starved madmen. My spine shudders just to think about it. If I did not have my miracle stone shard, keepsake of my grandfather, I may not have survived. If I did not have my miracle stone... Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch in your belongings. If only something could be done to help him. Nope. Wait. Where are you off to? All right, I'll see if I can go do the Tower Knight. All right, so I'm in a much better spot. Let's uh, let's go just nuke one of these fools. Forgot to suicide. What is it? Oh right, it has something to do with world tendency. You need the hairpin in your inventory to do his quest. So I don't remember how world tendency works. Dying in bodily form heavily blackens world tendency. Gotcha. So if I'm in half health mode all the time. It just works better. Okay. So what is world tendency? World tendency, uh... It's a weird mechanic that I don't fully understand, but effectively, whenever you die in this game or whenever you do certain things, the world either gets brighter or darker, and that actually changes enemies. Like, who's available? Uh... There's a couple of things. What was that about? Running off like that? Okay. So maybe I need it in my inventory? If only something could be done to help. Yeah, see, you he doesn't really care. Don't let them take it from you. That ornament then she didn't make oh, there it you after go. all. My dearest little baby. May she rest in peace. May I ask a favor? Would you mind giving me that hair ornament? I'd like to have it in memory of my daughter. Yeah, yes. You're the one who found <laughs> Why is no the default? Hello again. I'm keeping a close watch on you. Would you mind giving me that hair on? You're a saint. Thank you. Thank you so much. I mustn't forget. It's not much, but please accept this as thanks. I found it discarded on the main road. It might look ordinary, but it seems to possess a strange power. Anyway, I feel that you should have it. It will be happier in your hands. <laughs> 